hello everyone welcome back to my channel if this is your first time thank you for stopping by and to my returning subscribers thank you for the support so today we'll be making this beef stir fry spaghetti if you're interested sit back relax and enjoy these are some of the ingredients i'll be using for this beef stir fry here I have some chopped onions, I'm using white onions for this, I have chopped peppers, I have chopped red bell peppers, chopped green bell peppers, I have minced garlic and ginger put together, I have some salt, I have some seasoning cubes and the beef of course, as you can see the beef has been thinly cut into strips. So this is how you want to cut your beef for this recipe so let's mix so to the beef now I'll add in some curry powder I'll add in some thyme just sprinkle that I'll add in one seasoning cube I'll just crumble that in then I'll add in some of the minced garlic and ginger just drop that then I'll add in some salt and then mix everything together. I'll mix until it is well combined, then I'll set it aside for later. In a pot of water, I'll add in some salt, then I'll add in a tiny little bit of vegetable oil. I'll cover and allow that to come to a boil. Now, before it boiled, I had to shift burners so that I'll use the other burner for stir fry. So, when the water boiled, I added in the spaghetti pasta I'll be using. And the spaghetti I'm using says to cook for just 5 minutes, which is exactly what I'll be doing. So I'll just cover it and allow it to boil. Now, in a pan, I'll add in some vegetable oil. Add in some of the chopped onions just to make the oil fragrant. And I'll stir that and allow it to fry for a few minutes. Once it has released its fragrance, I will then add in our beef strips and begin to fry. beef is frying I'll check on our pasta because it's five minutes already so I'll check just stir that to make sure it is well cooked and then I'll take it off the heat and just strain it and let cold water go over it and I'll set it aside I'll continue to stir the beef so it doesn't burn. I'll keep stirring it at interval until it is well cooked and fried.
now that the beef is ready i'll take it out of the oil and prepare to make a stir fry At this point, cooking becomes really fast. I've reduced the oil I used in frying the beef. So now in goes the remaining chopped onion. I'll stir fry that for a bit until it is translucent before I begin to add in other ingredients. So once it is translucent, I'm adding the minced garlic and ginger. I'll stir fry that too for a bit until I perceive its fragrance. All I'm doing now is stirring it so it doesn't burn. Just keep stirring that around. And then once it is fragrant enough, I'll add in the chopped peppers and continue to stir that around so it doesn't burn. That is exactly what I'm doing at the moment. Just mixing, 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 stirring, stirring, stirring so it doesn't burn. Now once all of that is well fried, I will add in our red bell peppers, peppers and the green bell peppers. Then I will mix that around. Just mix that quickly so it doesn't overcook. Once that is well mixed, I'll add in some curry powder, the remaining seasoning cube, I'll just crumble, crumble that in, and some paprika powder, some salt, and then the beef. And now I'll mix everything together. Just continue to mix until it is well combined. At this point, I'll taste for seasoning and I'm happy with the outcome. So I'll just stir some more, continue stirring it, and then I'll add in a cooked pasta and continue to mix until it is well combined with the sauce. I had to switch spoons to a more comfortable one. So I switched to this plastic one that is a bit more comfortable to move around. So I'll just keep stirring and stirring until it is well combined with the sauce. That's what I'll be doing now. have watched to this point please and you are not subscribed yet please consider subscribing just hit on that subscribe button it is absolutely free and then give this video a thumbs up if you like the video don't forget to share with your friends and love ones because that will really make me happy thank you very much
So we we'll just continue to mix this until the spaghetti is well coated in the sauce. That's exactly what I'm doing. We we'll just continue to mix, mix, and mix. Now I'll taste the pasta to be sure the marriage between the pasta and the sauce is actually a success. <laughs> now that I'm happy with the taste, I'll just stir fry it for a few more minutes. And at this point, our beef stir fry spaghetti is ready. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and of course, subscribe. Continue to stay safe. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.